I always love looting these wee survival shelters. This one is no exception. Inside, you can bag yourself a wee plastic pumpkin and plenty of bubblegum and gumdrops, as well as a baseball cap that kind of looks like the one from Gravity Falls. No, it's not that at all, actually. I'm just remembering the colors. <laughs> so, uh, do you know what? I never... And toothbrush? Ah, uh, so they've obviously trick-or-treated with someone who, you know, they give out bubblegum and then they give out a toothbrush. All right. Now, let's have a wee look. I've never, never really looked into... Bubblegum gives you 10 HP. That's not the worst thing, I guess. They've a pretty much no carry weight. If you carry 10 of them, they're worth 50. Give you 10 rads. What's that compared to a normal stim pack with no, like, add-ons? Oh, it's just 30%. I forgot about that. Um, hmm. I mean, the way, the way less than Tato flowers, and probably a few other things. Okay, but they don't... They give you less rads. That would probably be one of the good things. So actually stocking up in bubblegum or gumdrops would actually make sense. Yeah. 10 of them, 100 HP. That's not too bad. What are you over here? Caravan guards. Huh? What, what caravan, good sirs and madams, are you guarding? Because I don't see any. The AI's turned on, so... Right, okay. <laughs> it's just one of them strange things that happens. Don't know where we are beside Cabot House and Bunker Hill, directly in the middle before crossing over the bridge. This will actually be one of the final sections we go over to um, in terms of the city, but there's about seven sections. And this just so happens to be one of the final ones. So we won't be crossing that bridge for quite some time. Uh, but needless to say, hundreds more locations to do. If you want to follow along, the full spreadsheet and playlist are in the description alongside my socials. I actually do shorts on TikTok and Instagram. Be sure to have a look and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.